MS Word 2010. MS Word is a word processing software that enables us to perform writing and editing functions. Letters, documents, etc. can be easily created in MS Word. There are several tools and features of MS Word that make our work easier. One such important feature is Mail Merge. Mail Merge enables us to create multiple copies of the same document so that they can be sent to multiple recipients. These documents have layout, formatting, text and graphics. Let us consider an example to understand Mail Merge. Suppose that as a class representative, you have to send an invitation letter for class picnic to all the teachers and office staff members, totaling up to 73. There are two ways of proceeding with this. One, you can type the letter once, make copies and then send it to all the recipients without personalizing. That will not be appropriate because it will not be a personalized invitation as it lacks name, address, etc. The second option is to make 73 soft copies of the letter, personalize them manually and then send. This sounds very tedious and is prone to errors too. There is a third way to do this task. Mail merge can be used to personalize all the 73 copies automatically. MS Word 2010 assists you in creating your first merged document by providing a wizard. To open the wizard, follow these steps. Open the Mailings tab in the ribbon and click on Start Mail Merge option to display a drop-down menu. Click on the Step-by-Step -step Mail Merge Wizard option to open the Mail Merge Wizard. Keep Letters option selected and click on Next Starting Document link to open Go to Step 2 of the wizard. Keep Use the Current Document option selected and click on Next Select Recipients link to open Go to Step 3 of the wizard. You can select recipients from an existing list or a new list can be created in Word. We can select recipients by two ways. Use an existing list or type a new list. Let's take type a new list option to create recipients list. First, select the type a new list radio button on the select recipients window and then click on create link to open the new address list dialog box. Type the title first name and last name for the recipients. You can create a new row by clicking on the new entry button. Now click on OK button after typing all the names to open the save address list dialog box. Give the file name as picnic list and click save to open the mail merge recipients list. Click on OK to get back to the Mail Merge Wizard dialog box. If you want to add information from your mailing list to your document, you can add the merge fields one at a time. To do this, click where you want to add the Mail Merge field in your document. Select the drop-down list next to the Insert Merge field and then select the field name. If your field name is not available in the list, choose the Insert Merge Field button. Now choose Database Fields to see the list of fields that are in your data source. Now you are all set to write the letter. To create the invitation letter, first of all, click on the Write Your Letter link on the Mail Merge Wizard to open the Write Your Letter dialog box. Write your letter the way you want. Remember to insert address block and greeting line wherever you want an address or name inserted for each recipient. 
Now click on the preview your letters link after you finish the letter to open the preview your letters dialog box. All that's left to do is to print all the letters. In the preview your letters dialog box, use the next and previous icons to preview all individual letters. Click on the complete the merge link to finish the process of merging. Now you are ready to take printouts or customize each letter further. To print the document, click on print line. Merge to printer dialog box will appear. Select all or current record radio button. Click OK option to open print dialog box.